I've got the Seven Sigma standard airway in this mannequin and I'm going to demonstrate the suite of the micro skills. The suite of the micro skills consists of the tongue depressor assisted scissor maneuver, the salad pinch, and the salad poke. We'll begin with the tongue depressor assisted scissor maneuver. I'm going to place the tongue depressor as deep as I can into the mouth of the mannequin, almost to the ba basically to the base of the tongue. And I'm going to use my middle finger against the mannequin's upper dentition behind the canine, more towards the molars if I can. And I'm going to grasp the tongue depressor with my thumb and forefinger, my first finger, and I'm going to push the mandible inferiorly contain the tongue into the floor of the mouth of the mannequin and then I'm going to use that to uh, allow me to uh, place my uh, video Mac here. I'm going to sync this video Mac here with uh, one of my external videos here. <clears throat> I'm going to place it straight over the top of that tongue depressor so that I'm compressing both the tongue and the tongue depressor and now that I don't need that tongue depressor I'm going to take it out. If I need to protect the upper dentition, I can leave the tongue depressor between the um, laryngoscope and the upper dentition. What I'm going to do now is concentrate on uh, getting the view here now. I'm going to come around the base of the tongue. You can see the tip of the epiglottis on video laryngoscopy. For me to get the tip of this laryngoscope blade a little bit more anteriorly and a, and a little bit more into the vollecula. I'm going to do the salad pinch. The pinch is where I grasp the blade with my free hand. In lieu of simply putting this hand behind my back, which is basically sort of like what we're, what we're always doing, of course many of us are doing this external laryngeal manipulation, I think that the micro skill of actually using the right hand to do small tiny movements with the blade make more sense. I'm going to help the laryngoscope tip go into the vollecula, engage that area epiglottic ligament, and this is without uh, levering on the top teeth. I'm pushing this in. I'm getting a wonderful view. That's, a, that's the salad pinch. What I'm going to do now is the salad poke where I stick my finger into the mouth to make sure that the tongue is not hanging over the delivery channel of the tracheal tube. It's free and clear, grade one on video laryngoscopy. I'm going to bend over and I'm getting uh, grade 2A. I have to get a little, this mannequin is a little bit low for me. What I'm going to do now is a tube delivery maneuver. I'm going to grasp the tracheal tube from the very top <clears throat> of the stylet. This is a stylet intended for a UE uh, medical video laryngoscope. Uh, it looks a little bit like a glide scope. Style up. What I like to point out is that if I hold it from the top, I can use my elbow to create that circular motion where the tube just easily comes around the base of the tongue. I'm going to go ahead and remove my own stylet just by using my own thumb because I am at the top of the stylet. I can remove to a large degree my own stylet. The mannequin needs a little bit of lubricant. If I want to remove my own stylet at this point, I'm going to take a step to the side, hold the laryngoscope and the tracheal tube together, grasp the stylet. This is a rigid stylet, like a glide scope stylet. You can't pull it straight out. It has to be brought out in an arc. Cut.